Hi, I'm Keith Merrill. I'm here with Eric Long, and we're here to report on the River Club project, the complex, and where we are in reopening facility. As you know, there's two parts to the project. One is the rebuilding of this facility and the pool and watching and so forth. And the second is the rebranding and the new look of the River Club dining complex. In that regard, we had our third meeting today with the architect and the designer. And we continue to focus in on what we want that facility to look like and be in the future. Our goal is still the fourth quarter of next year. In regards to the rebuilding and the reopening of this facility, uh, Eric's going to give you a detailed update. I have good news and bad news in that regard. The bad news is this facility will not be open until the first quarter of next year. Our original goal is to try to have it open by the end of this year. But due to the shortage of materials, labor, and a whole bunch of issues in dealing with our contractor, uh, it does appears to be impossible to open it this year. We're hoping maybe end of January or early February. I'll let Eric give you the good news, and at this point I'll turn it over to him. All right, thank you, Mr. Merrill. Uh, so where we are, uh, we're located at the fitness center. And uh, as Mr. Merrill mentioned, we are going through a lot of uh, challenges with getting materials and, and uh, it's taking some time, but uh, we're moving through and uh, we are starting some of the uh, rebuild. Uh, we have the drywall starting tomorrow. You can see the material right behind us. And uh, we're working through some of the other materials. We have some of the uh, ceiling that uh, we're working on right now in the studio area. And then we'll work on uh, some of the bathroom facilities uh, in the near future. Uh, but it does still look like more like uh, the first quarter of uh, 2023 before completion of the fitness center. But on the good news, uh, we are uh, moving forward with some of our other amenities. So our bocce courts, uh, we regraded the courts uh, last week and uh, they're ready for play within the next few weeks. We have uh, some additional awnings that we're putting in um, starting uh, at the end of this week, beginning of next week. So you'll start to see those coming into play. And then uh, we also have our pools. So our Island Sound pool and our River Club pool, uh, we are starting to do the acid washing uh, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday of next week. And then we'll start uh, replacing our heaters and then our pool equipment towards the end of the, uh, December. So we hope to have the pools open by the end of December, beginning of January. So good signs on that. And uh, you'll start seeing those areas looking a lot better and uh, looking forward to some of the new amenities for the future. So we're located just outside the fitness center. The other big uh, accomplishment is replacement of the HVACs. Uh, this is now the third day into the installation of our HVAC units. I uh, just wanted to kind of know this on our condensers out here. We have raised the elevation. Obviously, uh, storm surge is a possibility and we want to make sure we can make every effort to uh, save these units for the future. So these are sitting up about 27 inches higher uh, than the base there. So it's great for the future and uh, we're replacing all the units as we speak and hopefully have all the HVACs completed within the next two weeks. So we're located at the uh, boat launch here. Uh, we will be opening uh, this up uh, probably by the end of next week. Uh, we need to do a little bit of uh, rehab here. Um, understand that the personal dock that we have, it's still going to be some time before we have that completed. So we're going to have that uh, not accessible but the ramp itself will be accessible and then our boat shuttle dock uh, we'll use that as a tether that people can use uh, until this dock and this uh, ramp is available uh, still have some a lot of time before this can be completed uh, we have the initial proposal and we're about to execute the contract on that but as far as the timing it's still some delays on that so we do want to be able to have this offering in the near future